Hello, this is Tony Messer here at PickerWeb. Just a quick video talking about domain names and I'll be explaining exactly what a domain name is and why you will need one. Well, the first question that we often hit, get from our customers is what exactly is a domain name? Well, a domain name, it just means that it's your address on the internet. In our case, our, our website is www.pickerweb.co.uk. So pickerweb.co.uk is our domain name. Now when you buy a domain name it's your property, nobody can take it from you and you will always have the opportunity to renew the domain name in advance of its expiry date. So let's have a look at ordering a domain name and then we can show you a little bit more. So if you wanted to just choose a domain name, I've just put a bit of gobbledygook in here at the top left hand corner and you'll see that I'm, I'm taken to a page where it says I want Pick a Web to register a new domain for me and you can see that there are several um, domain name showing and this one's ticked because I've selected the .com. Now .com domain names, these are the most popular domains and um, these are issued in the United States by an organization called ICANN, I-C-A-N-N and their website is ICANN.org. Um, the UK domains, uh, another popular one for UK customers and the .org.uk, these are issued in the, U in the UK by an organization called Nominet and their website is nominet.org.uk. Now these organizations, ICANN and Nominet, do not sell directly to the public. They will only sell through intermediaries such as PickerWeb and that's exactly where we come in. Now with the .com domains, you'll see here that you can register them for between one and ten years. This is the same for the .nets and the .orgs and all of the other um, domains which are issued in the United States. The only exceptions are here, the .eu domain name, these can be registered for one year at a time and the .co.uk's can be registered for two years at a time. So let's proceed and just order a .com and a .co.uk. You'll see you're taken to a, another page, you just need to enter a few details. This section here relates to the UK domain names. UK domains, when you're registering, you can specify whether you want to register it as an individual or as a limited company or a charity or um, whichever type of organization you are. Now, if you register it as an individual, you then have the option to have your details made confidential so that people can't see your address. Your telephone number is never published, but your address may be published on the who is. So if you wanted to remove that, you just tick that option there and just enter your, your details here, just enter your name. So I put Fred Bloggs. Um, and with the US domain names, for example, .com, you can order a separate who is privacy service and uh, that will allow your details again to be made confidential on the who is. The name set server section, if you're not sure about this, you just leave this as it is. All this is, this um, shows a default setting, it points to a uh, one of our servers which would be hosting the domain name if you decided that you wanted to go ahead and order a web hosting service for uh, for your website. But in this case we're just ordering a domain name, we're just taking it off of the market so that nobody else can, can, um, can take it from you. So we just press update cart and we're taken to a uh, next page just confirming our order showing the the amount payable and then we just click on checkout and all you would then do is just enter your details in here, your name, your address, telephone number, choose a password, confirm your payment type, um, agree to our terms of service and then you can complete your order. Okay, So it's all very straightforward and basically um, by purchasing a domain name you're taking it off of the market, it's your property, nobody else can register it. Now what will happen is that in advance of your domain name expiring, we will send you several renewal uh, reminders inviting you to renew the domain name. So you will always have first bite at the cherry, nobody's going to take it from you, you will always be able to renew your domain name. Okay, So hopefully that's explained the, uh, the domain names for you. I'm going to put together another video talking about web hosting just to explain the different types of web hosting. One last thing I'd just like to draw your attention to, on our home page, just click here for home, you'll see here we have some free internet uh, marketing training which is um, delivered to you in video format and uh, it's totally free, you don't need to be a PicaWeb customer or anything like that, absolutely free, fantastic videos which show you exactly step by step what you need to do to get your website to the top of Google and get a good position in Google and get loads of traffic coming in. So all you need to do is just click on here on the little clapperboard where it says tell me more, just enter your name and your email address and you will be taken, uh, you'll be sent the, uh, the video straight away. Okay, thank you very much for your time and I'll see you in another video. Bye bye.